Hi out there, it's Diane from Cheap Street Gallery here. Uh, Saturday, just got back from a walk. I've got rosy cheeks, I feel good about that. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'll show you very quickly what I'm, uh, roast your peppercorns. If nobody's ever done this before, it wakes up your pepper and it's such a, an amazing flavor, you won't believe it. So all you do is take your fry pan, the stove is on, there's nothing in the fry pan, okay? Do you see that? And I have no-name black peppercorns. I apologize if that was a little sudden. I'm trying to be quick because I know that the fry pan is already on and hot. So, hang on. Again, amateur at work here. Can't do two things at once half the time, but... Okay, so, pour in your peppercorns. Enough to coat the bottom. You can do more than that if you want. That's fine. I just have a little bit here. So I think you can see that. Spread them out just like that. Put them on the stove and start to heat, okay? So how long do you do this process for? I was hoping to show you at the end, but the point is in a couple of minutes from now, these suckers are gonna start popping, snapping, smoking, and you will smell the pepper coming out of here. That's how you know it's done, okay? You just keep occasionally tossing it. Do you see it's already starting to smoke? Okay. And I mean, if you breathe that in, you're going to sneeze for sure. So you roast them until they're dark black. Or again, if you can, maybe if you're lucky enough, you'll stick around long enough and we can get one to crack here while I'm talking to you. Oh, there, there goes one. Okay. Do you hear that? Anyway, it's just a couple of minutes. I'm going to end it there. And uh, once it's finished, uh, and the reason why, why are you doing this? Why am I bothering you with this? Because it releases the essential oils and again, wakes up your pepper. And if you're a foodie like I am, like millions of us are, you're going to love the way this tastes. Oh, there it is. Really official snapping and cracking. I've got it off the stove. If it gets too hot, you'll notice it'll turn into popcorn peppercorns. So I'm going to leave it at that and take them off the stove now. Let them naturally cool down. Again, that was maybe a minute or two. I have a mortar and pestle here, right there. There goes one of the peppercorns, just popped right out. And I'm going to grind it and then it's finished. And then I have this incredible pepper. And if you've never tried this, I highly recommend it. It's fabulous. Uh, anyway, back to my ginger tea. It's ginger tea because it's dry February. I'm doing it unofficially because this is Cheap Street Gallery. I can only do things in spirit. I can't donate money. <laughs> anyway, with uh, as always, when I end my videos, with kindness. And until next time, take care.